What's going on, everybody? Rob here, aka Trev2323, 23, 23, and who? Uh, Isaiah. Troy Palomalu. Um, <laughs> Remember the football player with the crazy hair? Uh, That's no. my four year old grandson. And this is my seven month old grandson. This is Adonis. Mr. Adonis. Dun, dun, dun. So that's my Gugus, and that's my Dadonis. And together they're my Gadonis. All right, either way, this is about the girl watt right here. Point to the girl watt. Where is it at? That right there. Yeah. All right. Now, there's a battery inside this cooler. Open up the cooler. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Pull it, pull it, pull it hard, hard, hard. <laughs> All right. That's a 48 volt battery. That's an LG Chempec and that's a, D a Dali BMS, okay? What I'm asking, what I'm telling you about this 48 volt uh -oh, grow watt system. Uh -oh. what do I do? Okay, just pick it up, it's okay. okay. The 48 volt grow watt system is a uh, 48 volt grow watt system, 3K 48 volts. Now I am saying that before you get this, think what? about it, because if okay, you're gonna make your pocket. own, if you're gonna, what? In Fix your hair. Oh. Don't put that in your pocket, put that right back down. The, the, if you're gonna purchase this 48 volt system, stand back here for people to see you. Okay. If you're gonna purchase this 48 volt system, I'm sorry. Uh, what it is is if you're gonna have regular batteries that have BMSs already on and started, you could go ahead and hook this right up. Look, wait, doing the dance. But <laughs> we all just woke up. But if you uh, if you're gonna make your own battery, if you're gonna make your own lithium battery and you're connecting your own BMS, this 48 volt system is gonna be hard to start up. You're gonna actually need a power supply, a benchtop power supply that handles 48 volts, 10 amps. Now I did not know that, so I have this grow watt system. I figured I could plug the grow watt inverter into the grid and then I could start charging the lithium battery uh i can start charging the lithium battery and get the dally bms started like that now people say you can short the uh oh you're heavy on one arm people say you can short the two negatives and it'll go on this is a 48 volt bms actually it's a, a, a 48 volt 100 amp bms it does not go like that it needs charge and it needs about 10 amps to charge so people say you could go ahead and put a 12 volt battery charger on this and start the daily bms well you're not because there's 44 volts in the battery right now not charged so if you're putting a 12 volt charger on it it's not even going to go on so i ordered a 48 volt 10 amp bench supply to get this kick started so if you are trying to kick start your your uh, daily bms for your 48 volt battery you're not going to be able to do it with this grow out inverter this grow watt inverter has to have a charged battery with a working bms in order it will not go on unless it senses and, and has the charged battery with a working bms in it other than that it will not go on just if you plug it into the grid Bye. all right either way talk to you later subscribe like and share okay <sighs>